dear speakers, beautiful audience, amazing table sponsors and crew, I want to say thank you in the way that I do. So, it was a packed bill for a near full house. Three speakers ready to rock and have no doubt. It was our honour to welcome Alan as our guest MC. And I hope you first time guests know yes is the place to be. A place where we receive support on our journey to grow. So we gave three hugs to stretch our comfort zones before going ballistic for the first speaker of the night whose jacket and shirt were a pure delight. <laughs> Tonight, Richard, who now looks a lot prettier by the way, Richard was our minister of inspiration who wished to communicate from a real situation. How our minds are a civil war of our creation and we don't have to stand on a chair to feel elation. Richard's statement is that if you're someone who's driven, you're likely the passenger of the life you're living. Because when you've got the cars and house, you might be nearly there. And it's the not knowing and doing that sees us tearing out our hair. But it was where people are dying where Richard learnt that success is not the things you've earned. You heard the truth. I hope it touched your heart and head. Success, simply, is not being dead. So, <laughs> dare to be wrong about who you are. Stop abusing yourself and dimming the light of your star. You are amazing, so please be inspired by yourself, for then you'll have found the key to unlock limitless wealth. Now, you could shit yourself and listen to the negative voice, or speak your story and make the choice to come from your heart, write your own script, remembering to do this so you make sure you're not in the crypt, because this is a treasure chest. Never forget, you're already complete. So you don't have to be perfect yet. And you can't get rid of the script, but you don't have to live it. True wealth is living your love and always giving. So give yourself a chance. Start looking within and get ready for your life to truly begin. Next, Alan bigged up our brilliant crew and sponsors before Ignite mic'd up Harry and it was time to move on to our former Yes Group chair seizing his moment to shine communicating that to ignite your life now is the time. Harry's designed life-changing courses for thousands of youth and through research has arrived at this simple truth that for a program to have lasting effect, the inspiration and follow-up have to connect. So his pledge was to help keep the momentum going so UPW seeds will keep on growing. And we need to be knowing, momentum works both ways. So have a big enough why so the what and how will always amaze. Now our friend Martin's Booth's days finished in June 2008. Be your authentic self was the message he gave. So his life we celebrated with a minute of dance. Remember to move whenever you get the chance. From Harry's heart, his message was this. There will be pain, but suffering doesn't need to exist. Because Harry's darkness held the forefathers he hated. And he knows that abuse is something too many can relate with. He's taken his worst day and turned it into his best so that now he is grateful for the day he left. The home and mother he loved so dearly. And after 10 years he at last saw clearly that anger is a poison but it's only hurting you. And change doesn't have to be complicated. That's the truth. If you use what you've been through and honour your story, it'll light up your life so never ignore the power of letting it out. Don't be constipated. Shift those initial meanings for a meaning greater and take a moment to honour yourself and know that training will result in true achievement of wealth that can't be measured, earned or really known except when it's given, helping others to grow. And you should know, Marjean didn't come here to pull any stunts and she's not a dude who looks like a lady, you bunch of... <laughs> Pause, pause, pause. Now, Margie's mission is to touch, move, and inspire people to live lives that every day are fired with true purpose, full of passion and power that will see their hearts blossom like a beautiful flower. Her epiphany? Honor her mission by following her heart, which was broken but got fixed by a guy called Harb. She marveled at the chance to speak here and share 
helping us to get the message out that's in there. She dared us to reveal what that message might be, connecting with the transformational energy to set us free as we experienced in pairs sharing the language of our hearts and knowing how it feels to connect with that glow and spark. She asked for at least three vehicles will help get the message out. The party bus and love is what it's all about. You have the choice and freedom to be whoever you wish and your heart is the broadband connection to experience bliss. The importance of this cannot be understated because authenticity and your message are wholly related. Because it takes just one person to connect with your message and millions can experience incredible blessings. Marjean's lesson, there has never been a more important time to live from your heart and beautifully shine. Your fingerprints design reveals the gift of you. So live your love and be love in all that you do. Yeah.